Here we are outside the assembly hall because it's senior school assessment week and we've got an exam just finishing behind us. That's why I am in whisper mode. But last week we had a lot going on. On Friday we had children in need, so we had non-uniform day. Plus we had a fair with stalls run by different tutor groups. We raised over £500 for children in need last Friday. We had our under 11 rugby festival taking place on Saturday. We had seven clubs uh, coming to take part. Fantastic uh, day of rugby, really enjoyable. We got some really good feedback from the club, so good that they had a good day. At the same time, we had our model United Nations team going to Queen's Taunton uh, for a, it's a big debating competition and they were representing the views of Japan. So uh, first time we've had a team there for a little while now. We had a borders trip to Plymouth on Sunday and uh, this week we have had Form 2 robotics workshops taking place yesterday. So this is part of our new partnership with Cognition Learning based in Buda coming in and doing robotics workshops with the prep school and with our Key Stage 3 uh, classes. We had a fair bit of sporting success last week. Our under 16 rugby team competed in the ISA National Sevens tournament and they came second. So they got into the final and just lost out in the final there. But to come second in a national competition is a fantastic achievement. So well done to the boys who took part in that. And our equestrian team is going from strength to strength. We've got our second uh, team through to the national uh, finals at Hickstead in May. So that's two teams and three individuals through uh, to to the finals there which is is a really toughly fought competition in the equestrian world here we are in with prep three with miss emerson because it is a big day for the prep school tomorrow they are competing for the quadri cup which is our annual spelling competition so a trophy for the winner tomorrow medals for class winners and most improved and best effort. So I look forward to seeing uh, the results of the Cordry Cup tomorrow. On Saturday, we have our first 10 Tours training day. We've got a lot of interest in the 10 Tours uh, this year. So they're going out on their first uh, training walk on Dartmoor. On Sunday, we've got a Bramco cross country event. I know we've got a number of pupils in the prep school and lower years of the senior school taking part in that. The borders are going karting in Exeter on Sunday and our senior school assessment week uh, continues into Monday and Tuesday and we have form three and four laser tag taking place on Wednesday evening so that's rearranged uh, when it was postponed following uh, the storm a couple of weeks ago and form five have their Christmas meal on Thursday night at Woodford Bridge. The music scholars have their next masterclass taking place on Thursday and the academic scholars are off to Plymouth Aquarium for their masterclass. On Friday, we have some uh, interesting sport coming up. We've got some mixed hockey against Bude Haven next week as well. We haven't had a mixed hockey match uh, for a little while, but we've got quite a few who are keen to take part. Uh, so that should be uh, a really good event. So looking ahead to some future events and dates your diary, the final week of term, we have our two carol services. The prep school carol service is taking place on the afternoon of Monday the 11th and the senior school carol service is taking place in the evening on Thursday the 14th of December. I look forward to seeing many of you there.